And here are your top 10 plays for week 1. Coming in at number 10 is Connor Pyatt's sneak attack, completely throwing off LA's defenses. Number 9. Holiday's pass to Palmer as Palmer makes his way inside the 10 yard line. But they couldn't do much more as the final score came to Sterling 31, Hornet 17. Eight, Baltimore's quarterback, Shiver McDembers, throws into three-man coverage, causing an interception by rookie Mahalulu. Mahalulu would take it all the way inside, just inside the five-yard line. Seven, Jed Jones passed to Francesco, bypassing all of Osaka's defenders for a touchdown. This back-and-forth game came to Osaka 33, Los Angeles 30. Number 6. Michael O'Connor passes to Barry, causing two defenders to run right into each other. Final score of this game, Las Vegas 27, Louisville 20. 5. As someone tries to get points on the board for the Minnesota-Delaware game, quarterback A.J. Baylock throws an interception to James Cruz, bringing it all the way into the Minnesota territory. Smithers throws to the back of the end zone as Ochincha Yocho barely keeping it in for a touchdown. That wasn't enough though as the final score came to Ghost 14, Iron 27. 3. Bubba Jones fumbles the ball giving Matthew Elliott an 80 yard score, beginning Cincinnati's slaughter of Edmonton. This is the play that turned it all around, causing Cincinnati to have 42 unanswered points. Number 2. Handoff to Meeks as he jumps Baltimore's defenders, running it in for a touchdown. Meeks would end up having 127 yards and two touchdowns that day. It was a close game, but it came down to Cleveland 27, Baltimore 34. And finally, in at number one, is Queen City's hands off to of Tony Henderson as he literally steps over Boston to score a touchdown. Final score, Boston 5, Queen City 23. And that's your top 10 plays for week one. See you next week.